वोट फॉर नेचर All of India is getting excited about elections in 2024 but this election has a twist what is that twist it's all about going eco friendly india is the world's largest democracy india also faces huge environmental challenges so this year the focus is on making elections sustainable Let's see how conducting elections not only cost a lot of money but also impacts the environment in a big way. When it comes to protecting our planet, the ECI is always in the forefront. During April to June 2024, India will be having general elections throughout the country to elect MPs to the parliament and also to elect assemblies in states. Andhra Pradesh, Arunachal Pradesh, Odisha, Sikkim and some by elections. Chief Election Commissioner Rajiv Kumar, the Election Commission of India is sensitive to environmentally sustainable elections. Due to this initiative, we are going to have green elections. While announcing the election schedule Mr Rajiv Kumar gave details about the green elections here are the steps that ECI is going to take to encourage eco-friendly practices in the election process steps for green elections completely ban single use plastic keeping paper used to the minimum using eco-friendly vehicles carpooling and using public transport issuing strict guidelines to the poll machinery and political parties for waste management reducing carbon footprint giving priority to double sided printing to reduce use of paper for printing voter list election campaigns so far have left a huge carbon footprint by burning fossil fuels and using microplastics in campaign literature now that the eci has taken the first step let us all support the decision towards green elections all political parties should take this green code seriously and implement it what is should keep an eye on the actions of the parties and should not vote to the candidate who violates these guidelines keep in mind there is an option not a cheers for green elections cheers for eco friendly elections